let's integrate from 0 to 2 the function u squared multiplied by the square root of u plus cube root of u. Before integrating, it is often important to simplify the expression inside of the integral, which is called integrand. So let me distribute u squared is multiplied by u to the one half because square root can be written as one half plus u squared is also multiplied by u to the one third remember the quick formula u raised to the n over m is u n goes to the top and by the top i mean the exponent at the top and then m goes to the root so now i need to collect those terms remember until we are done simplifying we did not start we do not start integrating yet so i have to write the integral sign make it beautiful looking like the stretched kind of s symbol and now don't forget the du at the end let's collect the exponents 2 plus 1 half is 4 over 2 plus 1 over 2 which is 5 over 2 plus 2 plus 1 third this is one third is uh, three times two six over three plus one over three that is seven over three and don't forget du now i can start integrating and now we're gonna use the power rule the moment i start integrating the sign of the integral disappears so i will change the color for you now it's going to be u five over two plus one over whatever that number is 5 or 2 plus 1 so you don't have to calculate it once which is convenient plus u 7 over 3 plus 1 over 7 over 3 plus 1 should i write down plus c no put the bar and write down 0 and 2 because we're working with the different integral we need limits of integration now u will be raised to 5 over 2 plus 2 over 2 is 7 over 2 divided by 7 over 2 when you divide by a fraction you can multiply by the reciprocal of that fraction so i'm multiplying by 2 7 plus u raised to the 7 over 3 plus 3 over 3 is 10 over 3 divided by 10 over 3 so now i will be multiplying by 3 over 10 are we done? No. The last step is to substitute 2 and 0. Now, I'm first substituting 2 everywhere I see u. Basically substituting the top first and then the bottom. The upper limit of integration and then the lower limit of integration into u. u is 2 and I'm going to color, color code it for you. Raised to the 7 over 2 plus... 3 over 10, 2 is inside, raised to the 10 over 3. Now, this is the important part. I highly recommend to put massive parentheses. These are not required. But the second ones are required. Negative sign. And then open new parentheses and plug the 0 into the u. So to make a good notes for you maybe i should mention i plugged the top here which was u equals to two and now in different color i will plug the bottom the lower limit lower limit of integration which is zero and zero in this case is the most pleasant part because you have zero plus zero but the negative sign is part of the formula so make sure you always have it and make sure you put these parentheses not to mess up the signs in between now I can just finish. Uh, the, the answer will be 2 over 7 times 2. Well, actually, we could collect 2 and 2 raised to the 7 over 2 plus 3 over 10 times 2, 10 over 3. We also could simplify because 10 and 5 times 2, blah, blah, blah. But do we really want to do that? If you do, go ahead and simplify some exponents. But you don't have to. You know, so I don't really big fan of the 7 over here. And while I'm fixing it, maybe you can tell me what's the approximate number for our answer. If you use your calculator, the approximate 
number is 6.2563. To visualize what we just did, I want to remind you that we had this original function inside of the integral from 0 to 2. Everything is in terms of u. Here is the function I'm talking about. The function has a name u equals u squared u to the one half. Well, it was just a square root. Let's keep it exactly the way it was originally. Square root of u plus cube root of u. And then we simplify it, remember, by distributing and collecting powers. So we found the area from u equals to 0 to u equals to 2. And as you can see from the graph, indeed, this area will be positive. And this is a visualization of how integrals can help us to calculate areas. But remember, areas is just one of the many, many applications of the integration. And you will learn them really soon.